Hi everyone, it's me Kristen coming to you from Intuitive Touch Body Spa and today I'm going to show you how to make your very own foaming hand soap. This also makes a really great gift and it's super easy to make. So I have this one that I already made and it's in an 8 ounce foaming hand soap dispenser with some lavender. And then I'm also going to show you today how to make one in a 12 ounce container and this is a glass container so you're able to use then citrus oils. So you don't really want to put citrus oils in plastic if they're going to sit for a long period of time because citrus oils can break down some plastics. So first we'll show you the 8 ounce container. I have this little container and I have about um, two tablespoons of castle soap. I'm going to pour that in there. And this is the castle soap I like to use. It's Dr. Bronner's. And this is the unscented version. I also like the, the gentle baby version. It's um, very light and easy on the skin. All right, so we have the castle soap in there. And I also like to add um, some oil or vitamin E into the soap mixture um, so it doesn't dry out the skin. So I use about um, a teaspoon of jojoba or like a, about a half of a dropper filled. And again, I like to use this brand. This is Levin Rose. I love it. And we're gonna add some essential oils. You can add about 10 to 30 drops depending on how strong you like it. So I'm gonna add about 15 drops of the lavender. So one, two, three, four. Okay. And now I'm going to add distilled water to the rest. And leave a little room at the top of your bottle so then you're able to put the, the foamy dispenser thing back in and then shake it up. And here you go, see, beautiful hand soap. Okay, now I'm gonna show you the 12 ounce version in the glass bottle. We're gonna start off with about four tablespoons, let's say, four tablespoons of castile soap. And I'm gonna add an entire dropper filled of uh, jojoba. So I'm gonna add another one since it didn't fill up all the way. And that would be about um, two teaspoons. And then I'm going to add some of my favorite blends. <laughs> so I'm gonna use lime <laughs> and grapefruit. It's a really refreshing blend. So I'm going to put um, 10 drops of lime. Mm. And then 10 drops of grapefruit. If I was going to try to open it with one hand, but I'm going to open it with two hands. And I'm going to add distilled water to the rest of the bottle. Making sure to leave a little bit of room at the top so you can fit the dispenser back in. And then shake it up. Beautiful. So there you have it. Okay, everyone, I hope that was easy enough for you to follow. And just remember, you can add more or less essential oils depending on your preference. 
and um, there are many options in your foaming uh, hand soap dispensers. This is the glass one. It's great for when you're using citrus oils. Uh, again, we have the little plastic one, and I did find another version, um, this stainless steel one. So just remember to have fun, make it yours, have fun with the blends. If you feel like the castor soap is too drying for your skin, try adding some vitamin E or some more um, jojoba or whatever carrier oil you are using. And uh, remember uh, to label it if you're giving it for gifts so people know what's in it. And enjoy, have fun, talk to you soon, bye.